During the course of your higher education, there is no escape from these two terms, cross-referencing and citation, especially when they are crucial parts of your assignment. In this video series, we will bring you through some useful guidelines on how to use the National Library Board's e-resources to strengthen your references and bolster your citation skills as well. Cross-referencing means checking and comparing with multiple sources to justify the credibility of information. Now, it would be helpful to have at least two sources which give you similar data. It is okay to use sources from various medias, such as websites, books, journals, or survey results. The skill of cross-referencing indicates that you have exercised diligence in the academic process of research. It also shows that you have made an effort to produce accurate and valid information. Alright, you are almost done with your assignment, but it is not over until you complete compiling your citations. Citation is practically listing down all the sources of information you had referred to. Sounds easy, doesn't it? Internationally, there are about four recognized citation formats. APA, MLA, Chicago, and Harvard. They are all similar in the sense that they are required to feature the author's name, date of publication, title of publication, and publishing company. Currently, there are useful tools such as citation-generating websites and embedded citation features in academic databases. Just like everything else, practice makes perfect. So keep practicing and eventually you will internalize this skill. To help you out in obtaining quality sources for cross-referencing and citation, proceed to the next video to find out more.